Hey guys, SourceFed here. I'm Lee Newton. And I'm Elliot Morgan. <laughs> We've all been there. It's 4.30 a.m. on a Monday morning. You wake up, you get ready to go to SourceFed, but then it hits you. Like a ton of bricks. Like a ton of flower pots. You grab said flower pot and you put it on your head like a good little flower. Who's a good little flower? Who's a good little flower? And then you grab a chainsaw and you rob a 7-Eleven. Now, before what? we get into... I mean, when in Rome, you know. So maybe we're not all like Stephen Frank Steele with three names as if he's a serial killer. Or someone who robs a gas station while dressed up as flower pots. And maybe most of us don't use chainsaws as our go-to weapon, but Australia's Stephen Frank Steele don't take no orders from nobody. The clerks at the station were terrified, so they called the police, as you do. Steele proceeded to moon them, knock over shelves of snacks, and demand that they give him money. They subsequently refused because they don't take no answers from nobody. Because we're all gonna die someday, but nobody deserves death by flower pot. Needless to say, the bandit was arrested. He was then charged with a bunch of stuff, like one count of going armed to cause fear, one count of public nuisance, two counts of willful damage, AKA throwing a tantrum, and one count of, uh, what's that thing called? Oh yeah, armed robbery. Now in the comments below, tell us, do you think there's a chance this guy's drunk? We'll never tell. Yeah, it's our little secret. We're not our gonna little tell secret. Yes or no? Tell us in the comments below. Yeah. We'll tell you if it's right somewhere, but we're mm -hmm. not gonna tell you where. It's a scavenger okay. hunt for you. Absolutely. While you're down there, why don't you scavenger hunt that like button and go ahead and unearth that subscribe button. Click this annotation for all your scavenger hunt needs that you do via YouTube. I'm Elliot yep. Morgan. I'm Lee Newton. Missed you, buddy. Missed you too. Yeah. It was really good, you know.